Hello and welcome back to this video series on Composer. In the previous video we introduced CSS and looked at changing the the elements of type which were the elements within this box here. In this video we're going to look at changing elements of class. So for instance let's assume you wanted to change this body text here. You wanted to highlight it with a yellow background and maybe use italic text using the italic button as such and that formats the text as we wish now if you're only using a, a small web page and you haven't got much to do then you might as well do that but if you're designing larger pages or complete websites or using a template you've downloaded then it's more professional to use CSS so I'm going to show you how to get that effect using the CSS elements of class so let's undo that change to get back to our original state. OK, click on the CSS icon. Now we're going to create a new style rule. So click on the palette icon there to create a new style rule. And this time, rather than elements of type, we're going to be dealing with elements of class. So check that radio button there. And we need to give our new style a name. As you see, Composer starts it with a, a full stop or a period. That's how you should name your classes starting with a full stop this one I'm going to name highlight so it's dot highlight create the style rule and the text we used italics and the background we'll set as yellow ok ok then highlight the text you wish to format and now in this element of class drop down box we have the highlight option. Click on that. And that highlights the text as such using our element that we've just created. OK, let's create another element of class. Let's say we want to call one Big Blue. I mean, what we want that one to do is make large, big, blue text. So go back to the CSS. Create a new style. Let's call that Big Blue style text let's use Arial font size 36 pixels color blue okay font style let's leave that as normal weight bold case all uppercase okay so let's affect that change to this part of the text, highlight the text, drop down box, big blue, and that applies the style that we've just created. And that wraps up this video on CSS, and I'll see you in the next one. 